Oh, welcome to the armory there. Hey, I heard about what happened in Babylon's lair. No worries. Persephone will cool off. Besides, with me fitting your kits, he won't stand a chance next time you find him. That reminds me, Gremlin was asking about you. Swing by the R&D lab when you've a chance. I just got the fabricator up and running again, so Gremlin's R&D shack is raring to go. Once I have the materials I need, that is. See you on the flippy floppy! <laughs> Persephone wants a word with you. Best head over to her office then. Okay, push comes to shove, I am totally throwing Hollywood under the bus. Agent? Well, it seems your complete and utter failure to assassinate Dr. Babylon may have yielded some positives. Wait, really? Intelligence suggests Babylon intended Soul to be more than just a brief pit stop. We need to find out what the Doctor's designs are. Friday has the details. Go see her. Now go back to work, before I have Carol in HR enact a performance review. I keep stock of every bottle I have, Agent. If one goes missing, I know who I'm sending for first. There is something to be said for classic sculpture. So stoic, so cold. Yet... Mayhem personnel, this is a reminder to please submit your vacation requests to HR by this time next week. This will give me ample time to deny them. Here, right? Let's fucking do this. Follow me. Well, if we're going to find out what Babylon and his Ministry of Pride are up to, we should start at the obvious source and beat up some Legion troopers, yeah? Friday. I doubt some lowly grunt is gonna know Babylon's master plans. Well, Legion uses drop pods to deploy troops rapidly. Get close to the launcher so I can determine where its command signal comes from. That should tell us where to look next. So, no interrogation scenes? And here I was gonna put on my bad cop persona. Suddenly, I'm glad we ain't captured nobody. Power! Keep going! 
I suspect you can sabotage the launcher if you fire at its weak points. Got it. Putting the location of Legion's outpost into your sin. Oh dear. It seems when Legion controls an area, they put numerous diabolical machines all over. Drop pod launchers, ice barrage weapons, and other terrible things. So how do we stop Legion from deploying those evil things? Hopefully by taking over the outpost. There's an elevator platform on the ground. Hack the console there and use the platform to reach the roof. No problem. I always make it to the top. Goodbye, Agent. Excellent. Once you reach the top, destroy Legion's equipment, then hack the large antenna so we can access their signal. Wonderful. In the future, you can use a mayhem-controlled outpost to see Legion activity in the area. Though, be careful attacking other Legion outposts now. My guess is they'll fortify their defenses with each one we take. Now, I just need some time to decrypt this data. Perfect! Then the agents can head to the location I just sent them. Kremlin? What are you up to? Well, with Legion now weak in this area, Mayhem can grab a few places of our own. Like a place I can meet up with the agents, for example. That sounds like good information, Gremlin. Oh, I'm glad you like it, Hardtack. When you get there, just set up some signal blockers outside the building so Legion can't find us. Hmm. This information we downloaded doesn't make sense. It looks like Babylon's takeout order from Scooter's genuine all-American charbecue. And now I'm hungry. Friday, let me see that order. Oh, Miss Brimstone. I didn't know you were listening in. Of course, here you are. Oh, oh, hey, if you're placing an order, I'll take a jumbo rack of ribs and... This is not an order for takeout, agent. This is an old Legion code. Friday, come to my office. I'll show you how to decrypt the data. Yes, Persephone. On my way. And Friday... I'm sending you a list of agents. Send up the signal and get them into Seoul. Now. We will start with Agent Rama. Um, of course. I can do that. So, uh, no barbecue then? Damn. Is 
that what I think it is? That's the last one. I'll be waiting inside to say howdy in person. Does this mean? Me a field agent? So did we get what we needed to find Legion? It seems we obtained a good lead actually, which Agent Rama will be following up on. Don't worry agents, we'll figure out why Babylon's here and how to stop him. In due time. As an immunologist, I was a hunter, tracking the sources of disease. Then a man-made plague hit Mumbai, spreading like wildfire across the subcontinent. Somehow, the madman of Legion infused the virus with the unholy power of dark matter. So I stole their medical technology, but there was just too little of it. And I had a nation to heal. Then came an offer that may one day help me capture all the Legion medicine I need. I do not trust Persephone. But I will risk anything to avenge my country and cure my people. Rama, are you there? Of course, Friday. What do you need of me? First, call your car. I enjoy a nice luxury sedan, but with quarter mile, who knows? You might get stuck with a pickup truck. I've updated your sin with a location. Head there. I'll give details on the way. Ah, I see the AR beacon now. So, what is going on? We have reason to believe that Legion's Ministry of Pride is far more embedded in Seoul than we initially suspected. Oh? How so? Well, that's exactly what we need you to find out. We know Babylon is in town, but who else? And why are they here? I need you to crack into some access points we have identified and feed me some data. I can do that. But tell me something, Friday. Why did you pick me for this task? Persephone chose you, actually. She said you were the only one for the job. And where is our illustrious leader currently? Just establish a connection to your sin, hack through the security protocol, and I'll handle the rest. Sending you the data currently. Uh-oh. Rama, 
I see Legion forces headed to your area. I see them, Friday. You'll need to stay close to the access point. Stray too far and your comm signal becomes too weak to carry the data. Yeah. Nicely done. I've updated your location with another access point. While you head there, I'll work on decrypting this. Friday, may I ask you something? Of course. I have been an agent for some time now. I was, after all, one of the first to join. And your service has been exemplary. But I did not join Mayhem to hunt down Persephone's old friends. I am here to save the people of Mumbai. I see what you're getting at, Rama, but our current objective is finding Dr. Babylon in Seoul. But the plague is in Mumbai. I understand. I can talk to Persephone. <sighs> Thank you, but I am perfectly capable of speaking to her myself. Of course. As you wish. It appears this time the surveillance device is a cherry tree. At least they're utilizing the natural environment, yeah? Uh-oh. Let me guess. More Legion interference. Exactly. You know what to do. I have everything. Give me a moment to look this over. Oh, and I'll send you the location of the next access point. While you do that, be a dear and put Persephone on the line. Oh, well, I'll see if she's busy. She is not too busy, Friday. Not for me. I'll, um, let her know. Rama, you summoned me? It appears as though you have forgotten our deal, Persephone. Our deal? I have always been direct with you. I joined Mayhem only so I might find the cause of the plague ravaging my homeland. And in the years since, I have gone on numerous missions for your causes. But you? You have not held up your end of the bargain. Is that right? It is. And I would appreciate if you did not act so coy about this. Well then, Rama, I apologize if I seem coy. But I've been doing my best. It's not as though Legion publishes its information on some blog. It is a good thing that we are not reliant on the internet for all our information. Right now, Rama, I need you to do this. I am, after all, the one who signs your checks. Yes, yes you are. But we are not done talking about this. You are correct, Rama. We are not. Just a scratch. See you later, then. I'm 
not gonna lie. You and Persephone? That was sort of awkward to listen to. I am making a reminder that you are an eavesdropper. Friday, what am I looking at? Oh, it's a spicy stir-fried rice cake. Quite delish and very popular in Korea. And you want me to stick my fingers in there to find your device? Um, yes? That was disgusting. But your sacrificing comfort will pay massive dividends, I promise. Oh, and Rama? Legion troops, I know. all the way over here. Your boss is an infuriating woman, Friday. You mean our boss? Currently, yes. But perhaps not for long. Oh, I see. So, what has all my errand running yielded, Friday? Anything useful? Oh, oh yes, loads. Babylon is in town, which we knew, but he's brought a bunch of his lieutenants along with him. Hammersmith, August Gaunt, Steel Toe. And what are they doing here? Well, that... That's still a bit of a mystery, I'm afraid. Right, what am I looking for, Friday? I don't know. Persephone put in these coordinates, not I. Just send me whatever's there and I'll see what I can find. How nice. You're picking up Legion, right? <laughs> you know me so well. No, it's Legion who I know. So what is this, huh? Babylon's bathroom schedule? The name of his childhood sled? No, it 
Bits, details on the Mumbai plague. I received word that Babylon had moved samples of the plague here to Seoul. I wanted to surprise you with it, but when you got testy... I may be a thief, Rama, but I always hold up my end of the deal. I see. So, are we good, Rama? Or are you handing in your two-week notice? No, Persephone. We are good. Excellent. See you back at base. can't make friends, make friends. With enough parts and a little ingenuity, you can create your own judgment-free zone. <laughs> Man, you won't believe this. Relic knew a guy, who knew a guy, and he hooked me up with some of the hottest VR enhancements. The rec room has all kinds of new shit. So, uh, yeah. Swing by whenever. Peace. Ready to fight? We're detecting a massive surge in the Soul energy grid. The source is the fusion reactor exhibit. Gremlin thinks Hammersmith is the most likely culprit, and Rama confirmed he is now in Seoul. Hammersmith is the nom de guerre of Magnus Taurus, a designer of weapons. At one time, he sold his services to the highest bidder. Allegiance or ideology did not matter, only his passion to create. Then one day, he simply vanished. Dr. Babylon thought he could force the Swedish upstart to work for Legion. But coercion was unnecessary. Torresen was eager to join the Ministry of Pride. They were a match made in heaven. Whatever technological monstrosity he plans to unleash, you must stop him. Hold on to your booty. Off we go, agents. On to the breach.
temperature to your preference. I'm so powerful. Hollywood, it's Claymore. I... Hey, can you make me a gun that will turn everyone naked? No, I cannot do that for you. Well, how hard could it be? It's just clothing, right? Yes, but the technology doesn't exist. I'll bet you Hammersmith knows how. Hold your tongue, laddie. Ever been in a coma? Imagine the worst night of your life playing on loop. One night your soul's finest, serving and protecting the people. Next thing you know, Joe Shitbag and his merry band of fuckwits show up. So you do your job. But then, of course, your job gets harder. They send in Joe Shitbag's big brother. And maybe you get a little too enthusiastic. Because maybe you don't understand just how flammable dark matter is. And poof. A year of your life goes up in smoke. You wake up to find they've replaced you with a machine. Some call it progress. I call it bullshit. Good to know there's people out there who agree with me. Now I'm locked, loaded, and ready for revenge. You know, just as soon as they take out my catheter. Superintendent General Chief Bot, get your ass in gear. We got a crime already in progress. All right, all right. Remember, I don't work for you. I work for Persephone. And the only reason I'm doing this is because someone owes someone a favor. Yeah, and that means, at least for the time being, you do work for me. So let's quit the guff, huh? Can I ask what this is about? KW Robotics is introducing their newest prototype. Rookie Bot. Okay. Rookie Bot features an artificial neural network that learns by observing. Rookie Bot is currently observing you. Hi, Mr. Gat. Great. My two least favorite things, partners and machines. Ahem. We hope that by observing you, Rookie Bot will be able to add a human touch to Soul Metro. Or maybe you just hire some humans. Ha ha. Are you joking? Humans are emotional, unpredictable. Just play ball with me here, okay? What am I looking for? Waste control ordinance violation. Some scuzz bucket failed to dispose of food waste in a standard 10 liter plastic bag. Although it appears the perpetrator has fled the scene of the crime. I ain't worried about that. In case you haven't noticed, I'm dealing with Legion at the moment. Yeah! Hope that was informative for you. What's next? Parking duty? Yeah. Keep up with that tone and I'll bust you down to animal control, smart guy. What am I supposed to do when I get there? It's not like I'm carrying a ticket book. Not even a cop anymore. You'll wait for the perp to return to his car. Then you'll approach him about his parking violation. Then you know the script. He'll say, come on, buddy. How about giving a guy a break? You'll say, hey, pal, I'm just trying to do my job here. Then he'll call you a fascist or a loser or a soulless sack of shit. Okay, okay, I think I get it. There it is. Clearly a violation of Article 32, subparagraph 4. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, Legion is here too. All right, bring it. Yeah. 
No car left. Guess my job's done here. Yo, Chief Bot, are you intentionally leading me to Legion? Are you questioning my integrity? Maybe I am. You have problems with me. Go crying to HR later. Right now, I need you to do your job. So what do we got next? Check forgery? No. Public urination. Of course. Look at all the horses I've got. What a surprise. Legion. Trespassing, I need you to check out. Yeah, yeah, I'll head there now. Mr. Gat, it is me, Rookiebot. I am using a private channel. What do you want? Mr. Gat, my pattern recognition function predicts that there may be Legion presence at the next location. Yeah, I know. My human brain picked up on that too. Also, I have detected micromodulations in Chief Bot's voice. I am sensing that he is not being entirely honest with you. You think? Yes, I do. Look, I can handle myself. I just want to finish this out so I can get back to my real job. Affirmative. Chief Bot, this better be the last one. Yes, I think we... Uh, um... I mean, Rookie Bot has learned just about everything we... Uh, she needs from you. Whatever, I don't give a shit. I just want you to be honest with me when this is all over. Are you questioning my integrity? Yeah, I am questioning your integrity. Bump. Okay, Chief Bot, what the fuck's this all about? We've been gathering telemetry data, creating a situational decision-making model based on you. Soon, we will integrate this GAT AI into our new fleet of cop officers. So, there'll be a whole army... of me? That's right. About fucking time!
to the youth out there. What is with your taste in music? Why are you dropping beats? You should be more careful. <laughs> to turn back now, right? Follow me. Here we go. is crazy. Agent, I've received a disturbing email. A group of pride troopers are threatening to shoot civilians. I've tracked their cell phone location for you. Okay, on my way. Like shooting fish in a barrel. In the AI community, we call something like this balls that message has moved. I've triangulated their cell phone location again. I'm sending you their coordinates. Hey, ma'am. The email specifically said, surrender Janelle Braddock or we start shooting non-combatants. Instead, you send the three stooges. So let's try this again. Give us Braddock or we start killing people. So this is all about Braddock? Who are these guys? Some of her disgruntled ex-Marine recruits. I'm sorry. I just... I was worried about Janelle. I figured the three of you could quietly handle the problem and Janelle would be none the wiser. I think that's sweet, but we both know Braddock can handle herself. Intellectually, yes, I know that, but look, can you please never bring this up with her? Your secret's safe with me. Thanks. We'll have to celebrate later, Glory. Hey, ma'am! I asked you once, I asked you twice. Now I gotta elevate the threat. Give us Braddock, or I'm gonna commandeer this vehicle and start running over pedestrians. Agent, I've got their coordinates. 
Could you please handle the problem? Of course. But I think you need to talk to Braddock. Honesty is the foundation of a strong relationship. If you want Braddock, you've got her. Persephone! Friday, stop putting my other agents in jeopardy. This is Braddock's problem, let Braddock handle it. Oh, great. So, uh, it looks like we've finally come to an agreement. Yes, but I warn you, be careful what you ask for. works. We have to trust each other. Things break when trust is lost. My whole family has served this country. From the big split to Desert Storm, America is in my blood. I trusted America. I trusted the Corps. I'm gonna hunt down every last one of those motherfuckers I trained. Everybody I put into Legion's hands. I'm gonna make Legion pay. And you can trust me on that. Janelle, we've received intelligence that some of your old recruits are here in Seoul. They're with Legion now. Of course. Motherfuckers. I've put one of them, Vasquez, on your map. I think they're up to something, so, um... Stay frosty. Yeah? Sure, Steph, sure. Just call me the Snowman. Hiya, Snowman. It's me, Hauser. Hauser. Me and your old Oscar company buddies wanted to thank you for making us the soldiers we are today. Oh, you're real soldiers now. That's new. Ah, there's that trademark sense of humor we all recall so fondly from boot camp. Watch your back, Gunny. Oscar Company is everywhere. Oh, but ain't my old DI, Sergeant Braddock. Oh, how I've missed you. Really, Vasquez? I ain't miss you. I've been waiting to give you a token of my gratitude. At first, I thought maybe one of those fresh fruit bouquets. Now I'm just thinking a bullet in the head. Come and try it, no pecker. Yeah, another washout loser from the core. Well, apparently he's lurking around Seoul. I've pinpointed him for you. Goody, goody. Janelle, you don't, you don't have to do this. Yes, I do. 
Why? Because... Look, you wouldn't understand. You were never military. This again. Steph, we can talk later. Right now I'm on a mission and I gotta see it through. <sighs> Schaefer. You really should have joined up. Legion's the best. You wouldn't believe their benefits package. Medical, dental, vision. They'll even match your 401k up to $500 a year. Fuck you, Schaefer. I will 401 kick your ass. Shouldn't have done that, Gunny. Lidecker's after you now. Oh, Lidecker. Hauser, why don't you tell her I'll find her? And when I do, I'll put my foot so far up her ass she'll sneeze boot polish. Steph. I've tracked Lidecker. I hope you can handle this much horsepower. Can I just ask, doesn't this feel like a trap? The way he's almost encouraging you? You worry too much. You don't worry enough. Lidecker. Heard about your boys? They died doing what they loved, trying to kill you. Same way you're gonna die. Jeez, I hope not. I've always dreamed I'd die by chocolate. What? Oh, I imagined one day I'd eat a whole bag of Baker's chocolate all by myself. Then after an intense bout of nausea, vomiting, and diarrhea, I'd die of theobromine poisoning. Well, good luck with that. Yeah! over to KW Robotics. Yeah? Why's that? The whole place is rigged to explode. See? The timers were connected to your old recruits' biosignals. Now that they're dead, those bombs are just ticking away. By my estimate, you've got just a few minutes before KW goes boom. To think, maybe if you weren't so bloodthirsty, KW and his many employees would be safe right now. But if you hadn't rigged, you know what? Forget it. I'm about to rain on your little fireworks show, Hauser. Janelle, don't! It's suicide! Steph, I molded these men. I have a part in this. Now I gotta undo what they done. Can you understand? Janelle? Be safe? If you wanted safe, you would have taken up with Debbie and Legal. and you're short on time.
Good to have. Two bombs to go. Where are you? I'm around, Gunny. Keep your eyes open. Steph, this isn't over. I know. So, I guess we just take it one day at a time? One day at a time. 